the patent system was designed to advance science and innovation. I think that a growing body of evidence is showing that innovation has been on the decline and that's partly due to the pharmaceutical industry spending too much money on marketing and not enough on research and development. But partly also I think that's due to the fact that we reached a new juncture in science. Uh, the number of new chemical entities there are to be researched is on the decline. I think that the patent system needs to be revisited to think about how to truly incentivize innovation going into a new millennium. It's necessary to have people uh, looking at these things, particularly the, the multinationals are very strong, very rich companies. That's going down a bit at the moment because they're not discovering new drugs. Um, but necessary for somebody to question that, that we need to have some balance between uh, what ne people who need the drugs receive and also between the needs of the developed countries who are relying ever more on the fact that they have uh, sophisticated industries and not the basic industries which the developing countries have taken in uh, to a significant extent. Italy, Switzerland, France, Germany, all of these countries developed their domestic drug industries in the absence of a patent law. And other countries did the same thing for other sectors as well. Japan, South Korea, and Taiwan, they all developed economically and technologically, again, by copying. I think that it's important to think about the idea of public participation and open democratic systems because the World Trade Organization does allow these flexibilities for communities. And I think part of what the public can do to support these movements is really empower communities with technical assistance and tools for capacity building to allow them to engage in a really meaningful way within these systems. We need to evolve some new vision of what the patent system is going to look like and how our trade systems are going to adopt this new system. I think that the pharmaceutical industry on principle wants to keep the patent system so it can retain ownership rights in all these low and middle income countries. But I don't think on principle they're opposed to the idea of giving lower income populations access to medicines. I think they're realizing that their business model of withholding drugs from poor countries is actually out of date and it's time for a change.